Hey guys, welcome back to That Tommy Girl. So today I'm bringing back my sewing machine because we're doing a DIY and you will see a lot of my sewing machine this summer um, because I'm planning to really practice my sewing skills this summer and also to bring to bring to life all of the designs and inspiration that I've collected throughout the year. So I hope you guys enjoy my DIY videos because you will be seeing a ton of them this summer including the one that I'll be showing you guys today. So if you've seen my $20 thrifted challenge video, you'll see that I thrifted this really nice uh, vintage CK jeans. I really like them but however they're really baggy and they're actually a size Eighth, I think but I just felt like I was missing skirts in my closet so I've decided to take those jeans and to make it into a skirt and here is the skirt that I've created and I'm in love with the final design um, I was really not expecting it to look that good so the two major steps in making this skirt come true is to make first of all the jeans into a skirt which is really easy you will see in the process it's really easy so what i've decided to do is to buy zippers and these will help me resize the jeans to make it into a nice fitting skirt and i love the result i love i love zippers i just find that zippers are a really nice detail what i really like about these jeans is that I was able to keep the um, the vintage, authentic look of the CK jeans, but also add a touch of a modern look. Anyways, enough of talking. I hope you guys will enjoy this design that I created. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure to thumbs up. And if you want to see more of DIYs, subscribe to my channel. Also, if you guys want to get notified every time I upload a video, make sure to click on the bell next to my subscribe button and you will get notified every time that I upload a video. So enough talking. I hope you guys enjoy this DIY and let's just start the video. I'm going to start by cutting my jeans into an approximate length that I would like my skirt to be. Then I'm going to unseam um, the thighs and the, the crotch area. And I'm just using this really helpful tool that is actually meant to unseam um, and to rip out thread. Okay, so here I unseam the thighs, as you guys can see. And now I'm just gonna unseam the crotch area. Now that everything has been unseamed, you can see that the leftover fabric from the crotch can overlay and create a flat area. Now to make the future steps easier, I've decided to cut both sides of the jeans so we can work the front and the back separately. For the back, you're just going to follow the natural new shape of the crotch area and pin it down and sew it. As for the front, you just repeat the same step. If you guys have ever noticed, jeans have most of the time a double seamed. So I'm just going to imitate that by sewing over the old seams. Next, I'm just taking my favorite pair of shorts that fits me really well. And I'm just going to imitate its shape 
to recreate a skirt. I don't really own any denim skirt, so I couldn't really use a denim skirt as a template. Um, also, I'm not giving any hem or seam allowances because adding the zipper will kind of um, give it that area. So yeah. Since I'm working with oversized jeans, I did have to cut the pockets of the jeans, so make sure to sew them back so they can be as useful as they were before. So the zipper part here gets kind of tricky, and I didn't really show you guys all the process of me pinning everything because it was actually a really long process. But basically, you're just going to use the zippers to connect the front and the back of the skirt and give the old jeans the shape of a skirt and it will accessorize your new pair of skirt. You will notice that the zipper is at mid-length of the waist, but the final result will be different, and I actually changed idea and decided to start the zipper at the waist and to let the rest of the zippers hang down my legs, and I really like the end look. And here to make the sewing process much easier, I'm just separating the front and the back and I'm just going to sew wherever I pinned. So here's the end look. I love the final result. It looks so good. It looks so much better than what I expected it to be. I love how I could still keep the CK vintage vibe still going on in the thrifted look but also make it modern by adding zippers and make it into a skirt. Also I really like the details of the zippers hanging down my legs and I love how I can adjust the zippers and if I'm ever too hot or need to run, I can just bring the zipper up a bit. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. I really liked the final design and yeah. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was so fun making this DIY denim skirt with zippers on the side. Um, it's probably my one of my favorite DIYs ever. I'm just really proud of it and I just can't wait to wear it during the summer. So I will include a sneak peek of my next video because a lot of you guys have been requesting it. Um, I'll be showing how I distress my long denim shorts and that's about it. And I hope you guys have an amazing day and I will see you guys next time. Bye!